Today in Tracy's basement, we have a mail call from Zachary. And it's big. Welcome back to the basement. Welcome to the channel if you've never been here before. Today we have a mail call from Zachary Lemire. He wanted to send us a few things to show off on the channel, which is so, so awesome. You know, Zach, that you did not have to do that. We always say we never expect anybody to send us anything, but it is so awesome when people do. It's this very, so, it's so highly cool. appreciated. It really, really is uh, appreciated. It's a big box. It's a very big box. Yeah, I'm going to have to open that over here. Because uh, that's this is surprising. It takes big up the box. whole table. <laughs> like, uh, you really didn't have to do this, man. But, of course uh, not. Thank you very much. I do know a couple of the things that are in there for you, but what I do know that is in there takes up maybe a maximum of a sixth of that box, so I have no idea what it's filling the rest. So, time to break out the shredder and get into this. From nice, big, wonderful box from Zachary. From the U.S. I don't know if anybody can hear me back here. I'm trying to cut over this box. Look, can it you, takes up the whole you camera. Can't even see me? Okay, I gotta get it down here. Okay, it's it. I gotta carve into this guy. Okay, opening her up, and it says non-spoiler oh. on the note. So give that a quick read. Excellent. Aloha from the land of lobsters, Maine. Ah, you're not actually that far from us. No, and uh, we're actually like our our island actually looks like a lobster claw. We're known for our lobster too. <laughs> <laughs> Pop Comic Maniac, a.k.a. Zach, here with a big box full of wonder and mystery. Will it be good? Will it be bad? Only time will tell. I'm sure it'll be fun. I'm sure it's going to be <laughs> excellent, Zach. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted to send this to thank you for doing what you do. Finding your YouTube channel re-sparked the nerd in me. I had forgotten what a thrill it is to be excited about getting figures and comics. How awesome it is to receive something I am passionate about. It is nice to know there are TMNT, Thundercats, and so many more as much as much as people who love as I do. <laughs> I think I Yeah, you butchered that. Over you that. butchered that. Keep it going. <laughs> Keep it going. No regrets. Keep up the great work. Enjoy the mystery and may Dashreda be with you always. Ah, Cowabunga. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. I'm removing the big brown paper. And first thing on top says me. He's got sticky notes. Uh -huh. See you know who started the sticky notes on everything? Derek. Yeah. Derek the border geek. It's all Derek because calls. we do it. And, well, we always put little notes on everything anyway, but Derek is the one who really brought it to the... Every single I, one. I was going to say mainstream, like, like, yeah, we're so mainstream. <laughs> yeah, so underground, underground little nerd community. But, all right, let's see what Zach sent me. It's very soft. It's very well packaged as well. Yeah, everything in here I'm looking at it is actually extremely well packaged. Oh, oh there's, there's stuff for Adriana, too. Oh. And I've got lots of bubble wrap to use for the... Next thing we send out, and this is... Oh, it feels like a comic or something. Oh, it is. It is comics. Yeah! <laughs> All right, cool. <laughs> so, as you guys know, I'm getting really big back into Red Sonia. It really has been. <laughs> and he sent a couple of... Oh, this one's actually two comics. They're so, both two comics. Oh, they are two. Okay, so I got this Red Sonia right here. Very blood-covered, grabby, oh, sexy, of course. There? And then I've got the not quite as sexy <laughs> Funko Pop uh, Red Sonia. I love that she's standing the snake. Though. Yeah, got this little <laughs> snake through the head there. That's pretty. That's pretty cute right there. And I've got Red Sonia uh, issue number zero of which run is this? I wonder because there's so many Red Sonia runs now. Uh, but issue number zero, and then issue number one on the other side. And Both these are of those have really cool art. these are very busy covers. Oh, this is the one where she's uh, she goes to the city in modern times. Oh, we were just talking. Yeah, I was about just that talking to our comic shop that. guy yeah. about that, and I said I wanted to check it out. So perfect, excellent, perfect timing. Actually, <laughs> I literally was just speaking to him about that. So awesome, excellent, great start. And the next thing is for you, and then I see three things for Missy. Oh, so we'll do those before we move on with the box. But okay. Missy's gonna be spoiled after this one. Missy's always spoiled. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it is a rock candy, and it is Batgirl. Cool. 
That is awesome. You guys know I love the rock candies. Yes. I've, I haven't opened nearly enough of them. I do have some yeah, in the backlog. But, oh my god, Batgirl is so cool. <laughs> and it's like the really classic looking Batgirl with the gray outfit and everything. Ha ha. <laughs> she is super cute. I love the rock candies so much. I love the style of them. I love her hair. I love the little pose. She's got the hand on the hip and everything. This is super awesome. Thank you very much, yeah. Zach. I love rock They're candies very cute. so much. You're going to get the stand out? It's in there. Yeah, well, you're not going to be able to stand up on the table <laughs> if you don't do it. There she is with her bright blue cape and all the bright yellow on the boots and the belt and the gloves and everything with the symbol across yeah. the front. She is so, Very so cool. adorable. Very I cool. love her. Very excellent job on these rock candies. They're some of my favorite things right I now. I like how they come with nice big stands, too. Yeah, they definitely stand yeah. up very nicely. <laughs> so this says Missy 1 on it, so I don't know if that means open it in that order or what, but it says Missy... Oh, I got the hiccup there. <laughs> it says Missy 1, and it is... <laughs> <laughs> It is... Oh, it's a puzzle racer! Oh, it's a racer! Oh, good! She's just going back to school. She, and you know what? She loves puzzle racers. She has a bunch of Shopkins ones, and she yeah. loves just taking them apart for the back Cool. Game. Well, she's got, now she's got a Ninja Turtle <laughs> one. That's awesome. Thank awesome, you very Zach. much. All right. Let's see what Missy 2... I will send... Uh, I'll put pictures on Instagram of uh, her with these, too, so you can uh, so you can see her enjoying them, too. Missy 2... Is, whoa! <laughs> Shopkins came oh. barreling out at me. <laughs> oh! Oh, Shopkins. She's Shopkins. So she has head. stickers. Yeah. Very they're cute my, stickers. Uh, She's obsessed with Shopkins. Yeah, they're my yeah. Uh, they're my most dreaded yeah. thing Jason's ever. Jason's nemesis. Well, I, I still get them for her because she loves them, and, and that's just what you do with your kids. Exactly. But they they get in my feet. They, they go right up in my feet. They get <laughs> stuck. We have a Roomba. They get stuck in the Roomba. The Roomba bats them all over the house. I hate the things, but Missy loves them, so that'll be good that's for her. We got two packs of season eight, which I didn't even know was out yet, so she'll be very excited about that. We keep track of the seasons, do you? I do, I'll pay attention. Oh, oh she is really going to love oh, this. Oh, that's an awesome set. It is Mega Constructs Ninja Turtles. So she, uh, well, like, actually, I shouldn't say she. We, <laughs> we watch the new Ninja Turtle show together because it actually is kind of awesome. It's awesome. I love it, it. It's, it's one really of the, well it's probably the best iteration of the Ninja Turtles in years. It is the new cartoon for sure. and she will absolutely she's big on the mega construct she's got pokemon ones uh and she has lots she of ninja turtle ones ninja she turtles. doesn't have this one uh but she does have ninja turtle ones and uh she loves them so she is going to absolutely love that thank you Zach. <laughs> thank you and then it's got three for me here so um, that's a little yeah up. there's uh three on me here on a layer so i don't know if there's an order to opening these things so i'm just going to do them as the order that they're layered. And this is... What's this? Oh, oh Peachy Hockey Cards! 1991 oh, and 1992. <laughs> and they're sealed. Those are... Oh, well, where did you find those? Oh, <laughs> uh, you know, I find these kinds of things at, like, flea markets and stuff yeah, all the time. True. So, I mean, you can get uh, old packs of cards, but yeah, they're all sealed and everything. That's crazy. I don't want to open them right now because uh, that'll make this video take, like, forever. <laughs> so, but, uh, going through That's them all cool. but thank you very much that is really cool thanks this is jason too and everything is really really well wrapped yeah you made like, sure nothing was getting damaged like seriously sure. <laughs> nothing is getting away from me here but it's actually coming off nice and easy too so like he's a professional get oh cool ah it's funny because actually you really wanted this that's more for me but you know what <laughs> it's got my name on it so i'm not giving it to you no. You, you gotta sleep sometime. No, no, it's mine. You're going uh, back to Alberta eventually. And that's where I'm going to claim it. And I'm gonna write my name on his leg. <laughs> Don't and everything. you dare. Just like, <laughs> just like the toys we find at the flea market. It's like, oh, look at that cool thing. I sent a Brad to my... Or, I sent a Brad. <laughs> I sent an Evil Lynn, a, a good old-fashioned retro Evil Lynn from Master Universe to my buddy John. Uh, but it had Brad written up the leg and just totally ruined the whole thing. He's like, you're supposed to write on the bottom of the foot, Brad. But yeah, this is really cool. So let's take this guy out and have a I'm look at him. I'm super excited about this. I, I don't think we've ever actually seen him in the wild anywhere. No, uh, he just came out recently. It was GameStop exclusive, but the GameStops around here didn't get him because, you know, Canada. Yeah. So we will take a look at him here. I cut open the top when I should have opened it from the bottom. Duh. This <laughs> is... Let's take the small thing, take the big thing through the small hole. Yeah. Going right back to, you know what? 
that's going to get comments right there. Why do they have tie wraps? You don't need them. It's a small collectible. You don't need tie wraps. So I'm going to give him to you to uh, review and describe, actually, because Tommy was your uh, crush ranger. He was. <laughs> so, this is so cool. I, I'm back and forth on the Jada medals. I like some of them and I don't like others, but I really like the Power Rangers. And this one is awesome. He's got an enormous amount of weight behind him. Right yeah, well, the, the Jada medals are heavy. His uh, hips actually swivel a bit there. I don't think the okay, other ones Okay, that's are. the first time I've seen that, yeah. But there's tons of detail. He's got all the gold and black and white, of course, with the tiger design on the helmet. He is holding Saba, the sword there. This is just so cool. I love his pose and everything. He looks like he's ready to fight. He's even got the little holster for the uh, laser guns that they use. This is super, super cool. I really love yeah. this a lot. That's a nice figure. I like that. I like the Power Rangers Jada medals. Yeah, they're really I'm, yeah. well done. I'm hit and miss like on the Jada medals, but I love the Power Rangers ones. Depends on the design of the character, yeah. I think. All right, Jason 3. And the first one was Jason 4, actually, so I guess there really is no order. So let's take this out, and this is... <laughs> In a pop protector, too. <laughs> and it is the Red Sonya Funko Pop. It was actually, I actually have a Red Sonya Funko Pop, but this is the um, standard one. Yep. I actually don't have this. I have the bloody one from Previews Exclusive. <laughs> so that's really cool. So I'll take her out and have a look at her. And there she is right there. As you guys know, we're slowing down on pops immensely, yep. but I'm on a huge Red Sonya kick. So obviously... I want Red Sonya <laughs> stuff. And uh, a lot of Red Sonya stuff is expensive. Yeah, there's not so, a whole lot of really affordable stuff. So, very cool to have this. She's got her classic trademark, you know, fire red hair. Uh, she's got her sword and, of course, her metal chain link bikini. bikini. <laughs> yeah, very cool. Uh, as sexy as a Funko can get, really, I guess you say. As sexy as a Funko Pop can get. Um, she does have cleavage. <laughs> The only pop I think I know with bigger cleavage is Elvira. Yeah. So, yes. That's... Yes, I'm comparing pop cleavage. Yeah. Okay. It's, it's I'm comparing weird. pop cleavage. <laughs> but yeah. She's got all the uh, usual details that you would find a Red Sonya pop. All the back of her is kind of covered by her hair, but she does have the trademark uh, bikini chain mail on. She's big brown boots. on her back there. Yeah. So, very cool. Thank you very much. Appreciate that. That is going to look cool with my new Red Sonya stuff that I just got. And this says Tracy1. So, I think the numbers were just to help, help him kind of keep track of what he got for everybody. I don't think there's a particular opening order. Because if there is, I screwed it up royally. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, that's cool. <laughs> that is neat. It is The Nightmare Before Christmas, and it is Oogie Boogie. So it's a reaction figure, and I'm, I'm hit and miss on reaction figures. Yeah, but that but doesn't his look, is really cool. Yeah, that doesn't look like your standard uh, reaction figure. No, a lot right? of them, you know, they they've got that really old school look, and they're just yeah. they, well, it's the case that makes it. It's the card. Yeah, it, uh, uh, reaction figures are all about the card. There, there are the few toys that you just you don't open up because it actually makes them look less cool. Yeah, they look better in yeah. the package. But, but him, he, he him, would you could cool take out. Took out. Yeah, he could take him out easy. He doesn't look like your standard. Actually, the whole line is like that. The whole line looks really good. Yeah, they just have kind of a, a yeah. slightly different look than the usual yeah. reaction. Reaction figures, figures uh, started failing when they started doing lines like. Uh, Arrow and the Flash and stuff. It's yeah. stuff that wasn't nostalgia. Yeah, exactly. Okay? And you kind of have to have a little bit of a nostalgia feel to really appreciate the uh, the lines like that. Yeah, like the Masters of the Universe ones they yeah, make and exactly. stuff like that. But it's all about the backing card. Definitely. For sure. <laughs> and I think I actually will probably still leave him in because he looks cool like that. But <laughs> he, yeah. he actually he looks awesome. He, he does. does a really cool little figure and he right. comes with Sally's leg, <laughs> which is awesome. Very cool. <laughs> very, yes. very cool. So that was everything from Zachary. This was totally awesome, man. You sent a lot of really, really cool stuff. If you had to pick something out of this pile of stuff that was your favorite, what would it be? Uh, I like the Ranger die cast, but I'm just treating all of the Red Sonya stuff as one thing. <laughs> so, so I can just say Red Sonya, because I really like Red Sonya. <laughs> That's one way to go about it. <laughs> I really, really like the Jada Metal too. I'm gonna have to go with Oogie Boogie today, just because really? that, that's so different. It is, it's a cool reaction it's figure. It's really cool and different and unexpected, and yeah. I love Nightmare Before Christmas. Yeah, love well, it to death. yeah, I know. You're one of those. There's three types of people in this world. There's people who absolutely love Nightmare Before Christmas and could watch it a million times a day. There's people who absolutely hate Nightmare Before Christmas 
and then there's me, the only person who's just like, if it's on, I'll watch it. I I'm literally the only person who has a middle ground on that movie. So, <laughs> it is a holiday classic. I'll say that. I'm just. But which holiday? I am the. Yeah, yeah, that's a fight for the ages. I am literally the only person who has a middle ground on that movie. It's good. I like it. Where's you guys? Let us know what you thought of this haul that Zachary sent us and what was your favorite out of all these items. Thank you again. Huge, huge thumbs up to Zachary for sending this stuff our way. This is absolutely awesome. Thank you so much. If you've enjoyed the video, please give us a big thumbs up, share with your friends, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. You can also follow us on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, and Snapchat at Tracy's Basement, Jason from TV on Twitter, and of course, as always, guys, keep coming back for more Tracy's Basement. Bye!